Hi hey y'all, it's Betsy from Cutting Corners Vinyl in Nederland, Texas. Today we have a fun video for you. Um, I finally felt good enough to go ahead and open up my new Cricut Maker, so I figured we'd do an unboxing video on it. Now, first things first, I went ahead and ordered this from HSN. I paid for this with my own money. Uh, it was $4.19 plus tax, and then on like their craft items, they have $5 shipping. This is the ultimate bundle, so it includes some extras. It's not just the basic machine. So we're gonna go ahead and use the scissors and open this baby up. I'm so excited about this. I haven't even gotten a chance to play with it. But I've been sick and when I originally ordered it, it's taken forever to get here. So, when we go ahead and open it up, I had a my packing slip which shows that I bought and paid for it. Um, it includes, let's see, this is craft board in black, natural, and white. There's 10 sheets of it, of each of those, which craft board is almost kind of like a poster board, which will be something fun to work with. So it's nice and thick. What else is in here? Let's see if we can get this big old machine out of here. This thing is heavy. Like it feels heavier than the Cricut Explore Air and the Explore Air 2. Because those are the machines that I've had. Let's set that up. Okay. Flip this back upright. Hopefully it's packaged in there good so I'm not messing it up by moving it around. Okay, scissors. I figured everything would all be in the box, but who knows. But this, I ordered the ultimate bundle. It wasn't much more, it was like 20 bucks more. Cause they were like $3.99 on Cricut. And um, that way I got extra stuff cause uh, I like getting ultimate bundles and stuff like that. So again, is in there oh my goodness that thing is heavy like ridiculously heavy so flip it around go ahead and open it up and we can tell you everything that's included with it okay so first things first when you open the box you get a let's get started to begin, go to Cricut.com for setup is what it says on this box. And it includes materials in here for your first project. This is the rotary fabric blade. Then we have the Cricut Maker Book, which has a welcome. Tells you everything about the Cricut Maker, how to design and all those fun kind of things. Tells about the rotary blade. Then it also includes, that's your USB cable to plug it into your computer. It came with two Cricut pins. It came with the washable fabric pin and the black stylus. It came with the bonded fabric blade, and it has a nice little pink blade holder. I like that. That's kind of cute. Then we have the scoring stylus, and it has the warranty information in there as well. So let's see. I'll go ahead and pull these out. That's how it's holding the machine in there. Oh, she's beautiful. We'll set her right here for just a second so we can go through the rest of the stuff that's in the box so that way I can get the box out of the way and I can unwrap her. Okay, so we have our power cable in there. Nothing unusual with that. They've used the same one for a while. 
I got some red cotton fabric. I got gold and pink glitter iron on, which as I said, I'm not a very big fan of Cricut, but we will mess with it. Then we, vinyl. Then I have the Cricut black and white regular adhesive vinyl. Then I've got the Strong Grit mat, which they look a little bit different from the old ones. There's, on the older ones, they had like a white box around the outside. It looks a little bit cleaner, sleeker looking. Then we got the fabric cutting mat. And last but not least, we got the light grip cutting mat. So I guess we didn't get a standard grip cutting mat, which is fine. I have plenty of those. So we're gonna go ahead and set her over there so we can take and unwrap this beauty. And then we're gonna, uh, probably our next video we do, we will do a kind of a setup video on how to set her up and then we will get into how to cut. So let's go ahead and open it up. Oh my goodness, it's shrink wrapped. Like they have that thing nice and protected. And I love the color of it. Like it's a little bit more sleek, I guess, modern. Don't get me wrong, I had the uh, Cricut, I ordered my Explore Air 2 off of HSN as well because I ordered the gold one. I cannot think of the girl's name who does all that stuff on HSN, but I ordered that one because it came with a year of Cricut Access. Even though I really don't use it that often, but I do like having those features. So as you can see, she's out of the box. That's where you plug in the USB. In the back we have uh, a place to plug in the power right down here and where you plug in your USB that goes to your computer. This is one over here I'm thinking is for to plug in if you're using like your iPad or whatever on it. So you just take and flip that up and then that automatically comes down so that's nice. So it looks like it'll hold your iPad up here nice because there's like a grooved tray right there to hold your iPad or iPhone. And then all this is held in by the phone. You still have your tool storage compartment, which is nice to have. The buttons are a little bit sleeker. There's no adjustable knob. So I guess you control all of that from the program. Then the cutting blade pops in and out just like so. Still the same standard cutting blade. So that's nice. Go ahead and close that. Same area for your pin. But there we go. I like the new layout of it. It seems nice and sleek. It's beautiful. I love that champagne color. So now I'm excited to play with it. So keep checking back and watching for our next video on how to set up the new Cricut Maker. And remember that we will be doing a scrap box drawing live on November the 4th on Facebook. So go check us out on Facebook. We do the drawings live on Facebook Live. So you can take and watch the video as it's happening. But we save the video so you can watch them after the fact. And we always message the winner through Facebook or email if we have their info. Like if it's an in-store person, sometimes we can't always message them because I can't read handwriting. But we always try to message the winner. Um, and remember for to be entered you take and subscribe to our youtube channel that's one entry like and share our facebook that's two subscribe to us on instagram twitter snapchat those are all additional entries and um all of my info all of my usernames are linked in the description box down below um and any purchases made online or in store also count towards the giveaway now this is off on a separate tangent i had a lot of people ask today about my makeup so i figured i'd go ahead and tell y'all in case y'all had questions this is the peach matte peach foundation that you get at sephora from Too Faced. it looks beautiful and i've had this on for like 10 hours already today because it is about five o'clock and i put it on at like seven o'clock this morning so 
So that's some good longevity. I mean, I haven't touched up, haven't powdered anything. Haven't touched up my lipstick, nothing. This is just the way it looks after a long day. So if you have any questions about that, also leave them down below. If you have any questions about any of this look, I will gladly answer any questions. Um, I get a lot of questions about my makeup, so I figured I'd go ahead and throw that in there. Um, remember, go ahead and subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, if you hit that little bell notification next to subscribe, it will notify you every single time I post a new video, or at least most of the time. And that will help keep you up to date on new SVGs, new products that we have coming out, um, new tutorials, those types of things. Because again, I do not do this so that way you'll sit there and spend all your money and buy all your products for me. I mean, I don't. I, I mean, this is my favorite thing in the entire world other than makeup, but she's a beauty. So again, just remember, go ahead and let me know if you like this video and you want to see more like this because I do get in shipments all the time of new products to try and things like that, whether it be shirts or equipment or different transfer tapes and stuff like that so I can go over some of those types of things with you. So just let me know if those are things that you're interested in and y'all thanks and y'all have a great day.